Hey guys, and welcome to Diamond Painting with Ruby Q. So, I got a package yesterday and I actually went outside last night to go get it after watching Pet Cemetery, which I shouldn't have done, but I ran for my life to get it and then I came back in my car and I drove to my house. I mean, it's down the hill, but anyway. So I got this package and I think it's from Home Fun on AliExpress. I'm not sure. I just opened it because it came like really wrapped. So I opened it a little bit. So let's check it out. And it is from Home Fun. I mean, it's messed up right here, but it's okay, I guess. I mean, the rest of the box looks fine. I think this is my mermaid, which I hope it is because I fell in love with this picture and I was like, I have to have it. So I got it. So let's open it up. Okay, here it is. Um, it has rubber bands, like really tight rubber bands. Okay, there's that one. Oops. I've heard both good and bad things about Home Fun, but I like that. Oh, I can't take this off. I like that you can choose round and square. This one's a round. Okay, so let's put that there for right now. And sorry for the crinkle. Ooh. Ooh, that looks interesting. Look at that. That's beautiful. And then here are the drills. They look really good. Actually, ooh, I really like them. They're not dull, which is good. Um, okay, I will put these to the side real quick. Here is the boat poking through. The little set, the boat, the pin, the tweezers, you know, yada, 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 you know the business. Let's see what else is in here. Nothing. All right. Let's get to this. Let's see what the canvas looks like. Okay. So far, so good. Wow. All right. Oh, and it comes with the foam roller. Okay. Cool. So, I've never had a painting come with the foam roller, but I think it's a nice touch. That way it doesn't, you know, fold in. It keeps it safe. I mean, the box came in actually, you know, pretty good. So, I am going to see if I can roll this the other way. I'm messing it up. This looks very difficult. I see a lot of people do this and they like do it so quick and I'm like, how did you do that without pausing the video? So, I'm just gonna pause it, I'll be back. All right, I'm back. So, I went ahead and I fixed the canvas up. I took some of the drills out. Um, so it came with the inventory sheet, which is great. Um, I'll be doing the inventory in a bit right now comes with the image. This is a 60 by 40 centimeter. And I want to show you some of the drills real quick. I like them. They look really good. Here are some of the colors. If you hear my baby in the background, he uh, he's laying down in his play mat. There's that pink, that yellow, this fire red, which is really pretty. I think this is for her hair. There's the orange. I think that's part of her hair or the fish. Here's some green. And I mean, it's pretty neat. They come in like these little, they're like tiny. I'm not used to these little small packet, like the little packages for the beads or the drills or the diamonds, whatever you want to call them. So let's get into the painting itself. So I had to be really careful to
to taking off the cover because sometimes the adhesive could come up, you know, and that's not good. So there it is. I think that, that's her face. So I think this is her hair, her face, her body. Oops, and that fell. Okay. Then let's do the other side. Okay, so let's take a look. So you can see her. So yeah, that looks pretty good. And then you can see the fish right here. Oops. The fish. Um, I don't notice anything bad with the canvas itself. It looks pretty good to me. I did notice maybe just a tiny bit, like a little bit of rivers, but they're not that bad. They're not as bad as, you know, what I've seen in other videos and such. Other canvases from other companies. Yeah, I shouldn't have took and taken off this whole thing, but I wanted to show you guys everything. I'll fix it later, but the clarity. So you see that? I don't. I don't know if that's a, those are bubbles or they don't look like. I think it's just a little bit of rivering. But the clarity is good in this. I see how people would want to get um, or want to use a light pad. I personally don't use a light pad. I use this lamp right here. It's an LED lamp that I got from Target for, it was on sale for $7. It's originally like $11, but I mean, it's really good because it lights up half of my room and at night, my room is very dim. So, you know, it, it helps me when I'm diamond painting at night. So here are some of the symbols. The N and the Q look similar. I like, I like it. I think it's okay. I think it's going to be fine. Uh, I didn't want to get a really big size, but I'm thinking maybe I should have just because I like the image. Um, I'll go ahead and do inventory and I'll let you know if I have everything. Hopefully I do. I'll be back. All right. So I did inventory and it says that for $9.39 I should have, I think it says 16 packs. Okay. So when I look, I have three large ones and one small one. But since all these are small, I'm thinking that maybe the big ones count as several. And that's why I only have, you know, four instead of 16. And the same goes with 310. It says I'm supposed to have 39, but I have seven large bags and four small ones. So I'll write them and see what's going on but overall i mean i think that i got a good size um i think that it's gonna look good so here is the key on the side i think it's gonna be a pain in the butt to kit my painting because of all these tiny little bags <laughs> But it's okay. They're really small. So I do want to show you guys something. Because I noticed that this is only on like, like the ends of the painting. So there's that right there. And it doesn't look like a bubble. It just kind of, I think it's like a river. And I don't think it's going to affect the painting. Also, I forgot to mention that the stickiness 
on this is I would say, you know, medium. It's it's not like ultimate sticky, but it's not not sticky. I think it's good enough. I think that if like I finish this, I'm gonna probably gonna use the Mod Podge. I'm not sure. I still gotta figure out what people use because I'm like terrified, you know. What if I mess it up? But I have seen some YouTube videos on how to seal your paintings. So hopefully I find a way to do it. <laughs> so that's today's unboxing. If you want to look this up, it is on Home Fun on AliExpress. This is a 60 by 40, which I think that it's not going to look pixelated. I think it's actually going to look pretty good for the size that I got. Oh, I didn't even, I didn't even tell you how much it was. And I seriously forgot. I'll put it in the description how much this painting was for me. But I hope that you guys liked this video. Please like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.